Welcome again everyone, uh, today we're going to complete the SSL handshake between the Nagio server and the agent. So I have here uh, my uh, Nagio server here. So uh, here, as we can see here, it's like, uh, cannot complete the uh, SSL handshake. So it's really simple how to do it. So I have here my uh, Nagio server and uh, to make it more easier, I connected with the SFTP to uh, my uh, Nagio server. So I'm going to the user and local Nagios etc. And I'm going to the services, which is the services I have it uh, the here. So. Uh, as last like, like uh, the one I have is like uh, you cannot complete the so I'm going to hear the user local Nagios and so I'm going to check here this is like last time we uh, we know it about the client and the key and CA so I'm going to define it here like for uh, the beginning here I'm going to make first with a minus a which is a CA certificate so I have it already we know this is like a CA certificate where is it uh, so it's in the ETC SSL here like it is SSL so like copy this one here like SSL or make it like more simpler like this and I'm gonna copy this one CA and I'm going to make it like this CA and also I'm going to put the CA underscore cert dot PM and uh, minus C which is a client certificate which is a uh, make it like a user user slash local slash nagios and slash etc ssl and what we have the file like the file for the clients here we have it like this so here this is a client so i have the file here so this is just like the clients make it like this and i'm going to put the client client cert dot pm and minus k which is a key so this is user local nagios uh, etc ssl sorry ssl and client certs and client cert dot key and save it and i'm going to copy all of this here put it here put it here here and here and save it and here i'm going to restart service nagios restart check your nagios everything working just fine here this is my agent the agent side here so here I'm going to tail minus F and I'm going to var log syslog so it's all the time like uh, Nagus cannot check like uh, it's trying to uh, to get the information and it cannot like because it's like there are uh, it's it didn't uh, present the certificate the, the certificate and cannot make the uh, SSL handshake so it's gonna take like depend on how you configure Nagus here so let's see And I'm 
going also to check this is a service NRP status so and I'm going to check again here I was gonna take like between like 30 30 seconds or minute until it check again all the services so I have here like the services CPU and total process and the current user SSH monitor and the swap so this is a like this is a better way to do it like this also check all the paths uh, like everything here like this is correct this is correct this is correct oh, sorry everything is here is correct and uh, also you have to make sure that uh, here in uh, here in the Nagios here so I'm going to the here Nagi, uh, user local Nagios this is my agent site so I'm going to the ETC and going to check in up here so make sure that you have this like search for allow here and make sure that you put here this is like this is allow hosts which is i give the ib address for my uh, for my server my nagios server make sure this is it you have it here and also in the etc uh, etc rdd and nrp here and also you put the nagios server here as well so this is a port, this is a Nagios, so and uh, oh, also like uh, like last time what we did in the so it's this one I will make it with a line here so make sure that you have it in line so it's line 106 so it will take like yes now it's as we can see here like this is a connection from my my nagio server this is a remote this is a ssl version and it's like this is every all the information like what we created last time like this is uh all this is uh this is my state nagios and Nagios department and this is a server name and this is a email so like this one it will work like this like because it's sorry here so refresh this is working just fine so it will keep going like it will check one by one so this is working and uh, i hope this video is going to help you and uh, in the next video i'm going to uh, make uh, uh like a installation really really uh, I'm not gonna take 
long time for making this uh, because the video I don't want to make the video really really long so I hope this video is going to help you and thank you for watching